News right now, three suspects speeding from Memphis police in a stolen car are now dead after crashing and hurting five other people, including an MPD officer. This all happened at the intersection of Hickory Hill and Knight Arnold on Thursday night. ABC 24 Scott Mattis is live at that intersection. And Scott, state investigators are now stepping in. How did this happen? Oh, good evening to you, Pepper. Yeah, like you said, live from Hickory Hill, as I understand from police reports that I obtained today from the Memphis Police Department, there were two separate incidents involving at least three people in a black 300C Chrysler vehicle uh, breaking into vehicles, one by the airport and then one in southeast Memphis. A short time later, around 7 o'clock, destruction and mayhem directly behind me, now leaving three dead. Friday morning, Tennessee Highway Patrol investigators mapping out the intersection of Hickory Hill and Knight Arnold looking for clues as to what caused Thursday night's deadly accident. Thursday night in what started out as police responding to two separate incidents of vehicle break-ins may have led to this disastrous crash, leaving two people dead and multiple people injured. It was like police cars everywhere. I didn't know what was going on. Memphis police responded to a call about criminal activity in the 6300 block of Global Drive around 5 p.m. That's when officers saw at least three suspects in a stolen vehicle. Moments later, they say that car took off. Police also said in a separate nearby incident, at least four guns were stolen after multiple vehicles were broken into. In both incidents, the suspects and getaway vehicle both matched. According to MPD's policies and procedures manual, vehicle pursuits are only authorized when an officer has probable cause to believe that one or more occupants of a fleeing vehicle have committed a violent felony. We're still working to learn if this was the case in this incident. Now, while fleeing MPD says nearly five miles away, the suspects crashed into several cars at Hickory Hill and Knight Arnold, sending four people to local hospitals in non-critical condition. I hate to hear, you know, what happened. MPD says the stolen vehicle then crashed into a pole where two people inside were found dead, while another was transported to Regional One in critical condition. Once again, back here live in Hickory Hill, Knight Arnold and Hickory Hill directly behind me where it all went down. Uh, like we've been talking about this evening, within the last two hours, that third suspect has died as a result of his injuries at Regional One. Now, uh, the Tennessee Highway Patrol, they are in charge of this investigation. I reached out to them for more information on their investigation, and I have yet to hear back. We'll keep you posted. For now, live in Hickory Hill, I'm Scott Mattis.